A woman on trial for murder could learn her fate next week. Amber Dalton is charged with stabbing Richard Holden to death in 2009. Her case went to the jury this afternoon. News 13's Kimberly King was in Transylvania County for closing arguments. Kim, what did the district attorney say? Darcel, he told jurors not to buy the defense's claim that Dalton was insane. The victim's fiancé was also stabbed but survived. Tonight, she talks to us about him and what she says she saw that night. My Richard's gone. He's in the ground, but he's right here in my heart. For the first time, he's Naomi Jean Barker is speaking out to remember her fiancé, Richard Holden. In court, she testified she saw Amber Dalton stab Richard multiple times. I want her to go to prison, and I want her to know what it feels like to be stuck in your own personal prison like I have been for almost five years. I hope the jury does justice and something that I can live with. In closing arguments, District Attorney Greg Newman asked the jury to not let Amber Dalton, quote, pull the wool over their eyes. Newman saying the insanity claim is untrue and Dalton's testimony of memory loss a lie. She was not insane. She knew exactly what she was doing. She stabbed him in the stomach. She chased him in the living room. She stabbed him. He fell over between the table, dining set, and the refrigerator in a fetal position. Jean testified in court that Amber Dalton originally came to their home saying she was repaying $55 she owed them. Dalton's mother, seen here walking on the right, came for closing arguments but had no comment. Jean now has only one hope, that the jury will deliver justice for the man she loved. And in my mind and in my thoughts every day of my life, I'll never forget him. The jury will reconvene at 9.30 Monday morning. It is comprised of six men and six women. One alternate replaced a juror who was dismissed for unknown reasons today.